वंदे गुरुपद द्वंद भक्त बिंद श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदवन मनोहर वाशाकल्पतरु के पास भविष पतितान पावनिभ वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुखंकोतिवाचाल पंगुंगिरी यत्की पातमहंग वंदे परमानंदम वृंदा हुई तुलसीदेवी पिया हुई केशव सच स्नभक्ति प्रदेवी सत्वी नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरों चरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीपत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमदाक्ष जगोदरण देय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदूह तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचनुत शरण्य भीतातिहम पुनपाल भवादिभूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणारिंद यत्दपल्लवन चंदमनी छटाय विस्फुरीजीतकूष्वदर्श पूर्णागर सागर सारमूर्ति साराधि कामयी कदाकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नितानंद श्रीअदगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नितानंद श्रीअद्वैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम राम आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बदा तो संकीर्तन पितर कमलायुताक्षाबरो दिजवरो जगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणावतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरबंदी तो दीपूप भुक्ति च मुक्ति दिनी भावाूपेन्न सदा नरा गंगातरंगरमणीयटाकलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषित वाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंग मदापहारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ बागी सजुष वदने लक्ष्मीजस् वक्षसी जस्ति हृदय संबीतमह भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 
गुरु श्रुति सर्व विपोद विमक्षनम हरि श्रुति सर्व विपोद विमक्षनम गुरुर अनुग्रह नईव प्रमाण पूर्ण प्रशांत है गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमांश जगदगुरु सेठ नथिंग अस्पिशियस दैन गुरु सेवा नो आदर प्रोसीडियर ऑफ भजन इज सो इम्पोर्टेंट लाइक गुरु सेवा बाय द मार्सी ऑफ गुरु सेवा वी कैन गेट द लोटस फीट ऑफ भगवान इटर्नल सेवा ऑफ भगवान सो इम्पोर्टेंट बट कॉमन पीपल दे हैव नो आइडिया अबाउट गुरु तत्व वैष्णव तत्व हाउ टू सर्व दे हैव नो आइडिया दैट्स वाई दे आर मिसलेड दैट्स वाई दे आर एक्चुअली मिसलेड नथिंग सो इम्पोर्टेंट दैन गुरु सेवा पॉइंट इज देर इफ आई कैन नॉट रियलाइज दैट माई लाइफ इज फॉर टू डेज ओनली If I cannot realize about the instability of my life, if I cannot realize, then I cannot find solution. Parikhit Maharaj wanted to put question in front of Shukadev Goswami. Parikhit Maharaj wanted to put question in front of Shukadev Goswami. Shonatun Goswami wanted to put question in front of. महाप्रभु दे वॉन्टेड टू पुट क्वेश्चन अथो पृछा संसिधि योगिना परम गुरु पुरुष से हो यत्कार्य मृय मानस सर्वथा मैन इज मोर्टल एनी टाइम वी कैन गो अवे इफ यू कैन रियलाइज दिस पॉइंट देन वी कैन ट्राई टू सर्च but i think if there is if there is a 800 crores of population all over the world we can count how many people those who are really interested to go out of maya those who are really interested to get the lotus feet of bhagwan ultimate because yogi gani can be there they are little bit interested about bhagwan in their own way they are doing some bhajan but those who are doing those who are interested about hari bhajan is most most rare so many siddhant vichar you know silopopad used to say those who are really clever those who are very intelligent those who want to do bhajan those who are really interested to bhajan they can see the far reaching consequent of far reaching consequent of what whatever thing you are doing maybe enjoyment collection of money lab puja protest whatever you are doing a sadhu upopa speaking can see the future because in material world there is so many lucrative offer we can get lab puja pratishtha enjoyment so many thing we can think we can get but popa three speaking those who are really sadhu they, they can realize the far reaching consequent of those thing for which you are running you like to get money property position everything you are very much interested you can realize सो तत्व जिज्ञासा दिव जीवस्व तत्व जिज्ञासा जीवस्व तत्व जिज्ञासा जीवस्व तत्व जिज्ञासा कैन कम वेन 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 यू कैन रियलाइज दैट आई एम आई एम टोटली हेल्पलेस इन दिस मेटेरियल पॉइंट वेन यू कैन रियलाइज रियली आई एम टोटली हेल्पलेस इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड माई बैंक मनी my many power man power education no no not nobody can save me nothing can save me then you can develop tattva jiggasa inside your heart 
जीवस्व तत्व जिज्ञासा जीवस्व तत्व जिज्ञासा तत्व जिज्ञासा कैन नट कम दाइक इन वेदांत सूत्र वेदांत सूत्र यू नो तत्व जिज्ञासा मान अथात ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा अथात तत्व जिज्ञासा अथात शब्द जिज्ञासा ऑल से अथात ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा इन वेदांत सूत्र वी नो अथात ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा भागवत इन भागवत जी महापुराण वी कैन फाइन अथात तत्व जिज्ञासा ऑल्सो इफ यू कैन इफ यू कैन ट्राई टू रियलाइज वाट इज दट इज द इनर मीनिंग ऑफ तत्व जिज्ञासा वाट इज द इनर मीनिंग ऑफ ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा तत्व जिज्ञासा यू कैन रियलाइज दैट इट इज एक्चुअली शब्द जिज्ञासा शब्द तत्व ब्रह्म तत्व मीन शब्द तत्व बिकॉज भगवान कमिंग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ साउंड इनकारनेशन वी आर हियरिंग हरिकथा फ्रॉम एलिवेटेड पर्सनैलिटीज बिकॉज दोज हरिकथाज आर ट्रांसेंडेंटल साउंड अप्राकृत शब्द ब्रह्म सो भगवान कमिंग इन दिस वर्ल्ड इन द फॉर्म ऑफ हरिनाम हरिकथा हरिकीर्तन दिस वे दिस आर कमिंग दैट्स वाई अथा तो ब्रह्म जिज्ञासा अथा तो शब्द जिज्ञासा ऑल्सो प्रैक्टिकल आई ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इट मे बी एट मंथ्स ए गो है वी कैन नॉट रिमेम्बर सो दिस वे वेन वी कैन रियलाइज दैट वी आर टोटली हेल्पलेस देन एंड ओनली देन वी कैन टेक सेल्टर ऑफ गुरु पात पद्म अदरवाइज वी आर not ready to submit unto the lotus feet of when we can realize we are totally helpless then and only then we can take shelter of guru padma otherwise so many people taking shelter of guru pad padma vaishnavas they are taking shelter they are taking shelter but not they are not 100% inclined they are not 100% inclined unto the lotus feet of guru vaishnav and popa speaking if we if i am not 100% inclined unto the lotus feet of guru pad padma if my diksha is not complete diksha if my diksha is not complete diksha i mean incomplete diksha because my submission is not perfect in that case i cannot get right in bhagavat seva popa speaking if your diksha is not complete diksha if your diksha is so called diksha in that case you cannot get right in bhagavat seva we cannot get right in bhagavat seva then what will happen pova speaking we can develop some sukriti only some sukriti next life you can see or if you, if this life you can rectify yourself then no question if you can realize this life then you can try to rectify yourself otherwise you will have to wait only you can get sukriti no right in bhagavat because main point is there we think we can do guru seva we think we can do guru seva by the help of this body mind intel everything mani power we can but we forget that gurudev is a prakita bhumika Gurudev is now. Gurudev is now in aprakit dhumika, always in aprakit dhumika. So I will have to go up to that level. If I am failure to go up to that level, aprakit do vastu ko bo prakit do gochon na hai. By material mind and body, by by material mind and body or material anything, we cannot serve Bhagwan or Guru Padpad. We cannot serve. but we are trying we are trying we are practicing actually by the help of material body and mind or money power material we cannot serve bhagwan but gurudev and bhagwan because bhagwan and gurudev same level if you are not ready to confess that gurudev and bhagwan not in same level then you are going to make offense because bhagwan speaking acharya mam bijaniya because bhagwan speaking acharya mam bijaniya i am acharya say bhagwan is aprakita level then gurudev also aprakita level because gurudev who is gurudev he is gurudev who is serving he is gurudev who is serving bhagwan 
all the 24 hours. You cannot discover even any fraction of second. You cannot discover even one fraction of second in the life of Guru Padma that he is going to rest from Bhagavad Seva. Not that. Baba speaking, he is Guru who is all the time, all the 24 hours, serving Guru Padma by body, speech and mind, all the time. He is engaged in Guru Seva. Prabhupada speaking, he is Siddha Mahatma, he is Siddha Guru, who has his eternal sorrow in eternal love. We are in confusion. We are in confusion about Guru Tattva. We think this is a big society. They have money power, thousands of followers. So it must be, it must be a Sadguru. But Prabhupada is not seeking like that. Popa is not speaking like that. Popa is speaking, Sadguru, Sadguru, Siddha Mahatma, Sadguru, he has his eternal sarup in eternal dham. He has his eternal sarup in eternal dham. And now he is acting as Guru here. Main point is that, main problem, we are going to make some Compromise between satsanga and satsanga. That is the vital point. Out, out of 100% people, out of 100%, 99.99%, if not more, if not more, they cannot understand what is satsanga, what is Upadeshamrita. For the past six weeks, we are discussing satsanga or satsanga. Utsahat nishchat dajyat tattat karma pavartanat Sango tyagat sato vritye This loka, Abhrabha Gashenipa You can go mad, so from different angle How possible it is there, I can get asasana If you are going to confine yourself in a room You are not going to mix with anybody Still you are doing asasana You are doing asasana inside your room you forget. You forget that you are doing a satsang. Maybe you are inside room, not going to talk with anybody, but still you are doing a satsang. A satsang mean? A satsang mean? All material sangha. A satsang mean which is not eternal, vastu or bhakti. Not eternal vastu or bhakti, we are doing sangha. So, if we are going to stay here alone, still we are doing asasanga mentally. So, mental asasanga is also very dangerous because in this space, this space you cannot see anything. This space, you know, you cannot see anything. But if you see through microscope, you can. Discover countless dust particles there in suspended condition. Water you are drinking, if you look through microscope, there is a countless suspension there. Water susp suspension. Follow. If you go to the space, you can find countless suspension. Some, you know, there is different star and planets, some broken part of, you know, some star and planet, you can find countless. Asteroids, countless. And at present, we human beings so dangerous, we are making garbage in the space. We are making garbage in the space. If you go and search, oh, so many broken things. All useless things in such a condition. So what I mean to say, if you can look inside your mind, you can see there is countless material things in suspended condition inside your mind. Your mind is matter. Though you cannot see your mind, but still your mind is matter. And in this mind, Bhakti Thakur told, Bhakti Thakur told, mind is chidavhash. Mind is not chidvastu. Mind is not chidvastu. We cannot see mind, but still Bhakti Muttav told, mind is chidabhas, not chidvastu. 
But this wicked mind, we can change by the association of Guru Vishnu. That is the only way. No other way. You go on worshipping Bhagavan for infinity pure. You can go on doing so many things, but without satsanga, without satsanga, there is no possibility. You can get bhakti, you can realize, no possibility. So if you look inside your mind, you can find countless material things there in suspended condition, but in fine form. Not in, it is there, matter there. If you don't believe me, you go inside your, close your room, close your eyes and think, all matter can come. You cannot deny, you cannot speak lie, you cannot deny. So while doing Harinam, your mind can do, go to America, Russia, France, Germany, anywhere you can go. Without any plane fare, without any passport visa, you can go to America, Russia, anything. your country, anytime. You can go back to your past incident happened in your life. All your past things you are thinking will happen. So matter is there, but in fine form. Matter is there in fine form, not in, you know, but fine form means also matter. Those who are great, great devotees, like Pradhunna, like uh, Pradhunna Brahmachari, I can give one example, then you can realize. Pradhunna Brahmachari can give. I can try to show the difference before between your mind and the mind of Pradhunna Brahmachari. Pradhunna Brahmachari wanted to decorate all the way through which Mahaprabhu was going to Vrindavan. Try to understand what I mean. Don't forget. Pradhunna Brahmachari wanted to serve Gauranga Mahaprabhu. He wanted to decorate whole way, all the way. Mahaprabhu going going to Vrindavan, he liked to decorate whole way. But not physically. He is sitting in meditation, by the help of Harinam, is in meditation, going to each and every spot through which Mahaprabhu is supposed to go. And he is going to put all this kind of flower, flowers. But even that stem is not there. Even the stem, without stem, had to open, stemless. So that when Mahaprabhu is going to put leg there, there is no problem can be there. All soft flowers going to arrange mentally and throw in whole load. He was successful up to, Kan up to Kanai Natsala. One spot, it is the border point of Bihar and Bengal. One spot there, you don't know, you can never go, I think. Because off, off, offline. It's offline. If I go to North Bengal, from there, if I go to Bihar, then it's spectacle. But from here, nobody understands which way. Kanai Natsala, from where Mahaprabhu came back. You can remember, Mahaprabhu wanted to go to Vrindavan one time, first time, then came back from Kanai Natsala. That is the place. And Pradhunna Brahmachari was 100% sanguine. Sure, that this time Mahaprabhu cannot go further. Mahaprabhu can come back from Kanan Arsala. Why, why, why? Because my mind not going further. Up to Kanan Arsala, he was successful to decorate all uh, floral way. All nice. But after Arsala, I cannot go. So, if matter is there in fine form, follow, you can convert it into reality. If your concentration is 100% right, you don't believe. Still now you cannot believe. I give the example of that, you know, Yadubangsa Dhangsa destruction. When those Manirishis were there in the outside garden of Daruka, then all small boys, I mean young boys of Jadubangsa, they wanted to make a joke. 
Aniruddha, Pradunna, I, uh, the uh, small grandsons of Krishna, you know, Sambhu, they wanted to play. They are asking that Rishi, this uh, lady is going to give birth to uh, some children, baby, but you please speak, uh, is a boy and girl. The Rishi cannot see, can see everything. We become very angry. You are joking with me? Then they say, yes, he can give birth, give birth one iron bar, mushal, iron bar. And immediately somebody discover there is one iron piece inside. How many examples I can give you? How many examples I can give you? I think you are not hearing Bihad uh, Harikatha properly. Bihad Bhagavadam Rita you can remember. Or Mahaprabhu also, uh, I, there is one document in Sastra. That one Brahman going to offer Kira, Paramana, mentally. is poor. At the bank of Kaveri, at the bank of Kaveri, is going to make Paramana. Finally, preparation done, immediation. And finally, he wanted to offer to Bhagavan, he wanted to test it. Is it now uh, okay? It's cool down? I can offer or I will have to wait more? He wanted to put one leg and he burn up. Burn up. And he discovered whole finger burned up. And Bhagavan Narayan laughing. In South India it happened. Bhagavan laughing and Lakshmi Devi asking, why you are laughing? Well, this, this is the case, my devotee. Similar way, I am giving this example, similar way, if you are successful to get Guru Kipa and if you are going to follow the actual method, method of bhajan, actual method of bhajan, shown by your Guru Padma, then today or tomorrow, what you are trying to get, now it is a dream. To get the lotus feet of Krishna is a dream to you. But if you are successful to get Guru Kipa, full Kipa, if your Harinam is okay, then today or tomorrow or day after tomorrow or someday, surely you are going to get that thing. That's why North Mutago told, Shadone, Shadone Bhabibeja Siddhite Paivataha. In Sadhan procedure, during Sadhan procedure, what you are going to expect? I am not speaking about all general people. Okay, I can take Tilak Mala, I can do Hare Krishna also. No idea about such. I am not speaking about them. I am speaking about those very, very sincere devotees. Very sincere devotees. Guru Shiva, Ginyang Pulkiva, for Abdham. Though they are doing in bhajan, in bhajan, they are doing and surely they are going to get that objective, final goal of their bhajan, they are going to get, meet the target. What to speak about this very, even jogis, even jogis, they can go anywhere. I know in my life, I went to, I went to Amar Ganga which is dangerous, except mountaineers, nobody should go. It is written. I went there. Gurudev protected me. There one, I meet with, with one Karnataka lady, black, like Kalima. Black fool, is yogi. For the past 30, 40, 40 years, she is doing yoga. Follow. So, there was Gufa, cave, cave. Then night time we took rest, but where that Mataji is saying we don't know. We two or two or three sadhus, and very from Nepal one sadhu and I also went there. And when Mataji get vanished, we don't know. Mataji allow on one cave, there you stay, and whatever you need, you ask. He is giving dal, rice, everything. Where from he is getting? Impossible to get. I asked next day, I asked Mataji that. 
Mata, Yogi Mata ji. That you, uh, you went to Ked Kedarnath, Bodhinath, you went? Eh? If you ever been there? She is telling, very often I am going. And how you are going? Then she is smiling. Fine form. If I need to go to Kedarnath, Bodhinath from that, I will have to spend two days, two, three days. I have to go Ram or more than that. But they can go in fine form. But the Naran looking, taking the Shankar is very open. Even in 11th Canto, Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Uddhavji Maharaj. How people can get Jokshiddhi, Anima, Logima, Prakamaka. I am not going to touch because it will take long time. It's very easy. They can get anything. They are not devotee. They are yogi. A gobi, they are not perfect devotee. They have annabilas. So they are sure. But they can get anything they like. But they can get. So why you cannot believe that if we can do Guru Shava with full faith, full concentration, with, with full concentration we are successful to do Harinam, we can get the target for which we are doing Bhadra. I mean, our final target. But main thing, our mind is very wicked. Our mind is very weak and wicked. Our mind is very wicked and weak. And we have no idea about satsanga satsanga. That is the main point. Because Prabhupada wanted to put guarantee in front of you. That satsanga means, satsanga means no asasanga. Prabhupada wanted to speak this way, but we cannot realize. Prabhupada speaking, you are doing satsanga, you are interested to do satsanga, that means surely there is no question of asasanga. Follow. Prabhupada speaking, you are doing satsanga, that means it is granted, there is no asasanga. But our satsanga means satsanga and asasanga mix. That's why we cannot get results so quickly. Maybe in the near future you can get. That is the main problem. We cannot get. But if we can get satsanga, actual satsanga, if we are in front of Guru Vaishnava but we are unable to get their sangha, it is our fault. Guru Vaishnava would like to give their high association, but we are unable. We are so foolish, we can to mix. You can make some hodgepodge. That's why you cannot. But we should learn how to do satsanga, how to serve Gurudev from my Guru Pat Padma, Sila Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. Such a sadhu is rare. When he was there, not that he gone, we are speaking. When he was there in this material world, that time, I told many times, and many big, big sadhus, they told that Bharati Maharaj, is, this kind of jewel is rare. Bharati Maharaj was one kind of jewel, is rare. Bharati Maharaj was one kind of property. You cannot realize. You can go and take Chana Rasa only, but you cannot realize. Bharati Maharaj was one kind of treasure, Bharati Maharaj was one kind of property for us, Gauriyamat. Bharati Maharaj gone means so many gone, so everything gone, but not gone, because in the form of Bani Sharu, Bharati Maharaj is there, he can help us. So to learn how to do Guru Seva, Vaishnav Seva, how to get good association, how we should sincerely go through the Leela of a life of Bhakti and Bharati Maharaj. We should go through the life of Bhakti and Bharati Maharaj. Otherwise, it is impossible for us. Any problem in the whole society, whole Gauri Vaishnava society, any problem arise. Any problem, big problem, how to solve? If we approach Bharati, you say Maharaj, Bharati Maharaj. He used to give solution. Solution. So high power, intuition. 
He can see past, present and future everything. He can see clearly. As a symptom of sadhu, a symptom of sadhu, he can see past, present and future. Maybe you can become angry by hearing all strong voice, but they can see your future. All past, present and future they can. A sadhu you can realize many times I told by his Guru Nishtha. How you can realize a sadhu by external position? How you can realize? By his Guru Nishtha and Sampradaya Nishtha. Many times repeatedly I told. Is the main vital point, symptom, by the help of which we can realize there is a real sadhu. Real sadhu must have strong faith in Guru Padma, Guru Varga, Sampradayak Unishtha. Not that from another Sampradayak He is also good sadhu Maharaj, I can hear, allow him to speak Harikatha, also I can come to Gauri Maharaj. What wrong in it? But wrong in it, why, what wrong in it? To realize you will have to take birth again and again. I think so. You cannot realize. Why? Big problem. So, unique. Srila Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj, Maharaj, his Guru Nishtha is one kind of history, evergreen, evergreen history for us. Evergreen history. We can touch this point or no, I don't know. He used to love me. This is one kind of advertisement. I like, don't like to speak. He used to love me. So I am a big monkey. You see, he used to love me. This is one kind of advertisement. I should not speak that way. How much love I had, I have for him. How much love I have for him. That is the main point. He can speak, I cannot speak. I cannot speak, he can pass remark. The Sam Baba is successful. He was in the line, he is in the line of Guru He can speak, he was the most neutral personality. Never, no politics, no pratishtha asa, nothing could touch. That is the most vital point. Nothing could touch his heart. But still, so many people wanted to, uh, they misunderstood him. Still, Vaishnav Chinitya Nare Vaishnava Shakti, Devere Shakti. Even demigods, they cannot understand the position of a Vaishnav. We can pass different kind of dirty remarks about Guru Vaishnav. Now, I like to touch some points because if I go on discussing about a Guru Seva, Vaishnava Seva, Sampradaya Nishtha, all, is I can go on speaking. Is Guru Nishtha. Sila Bhakti Vedita Madhav Goswami Maharaj. Sila Bhakti Vedita Madhav Goswami Maharaj. He was bound to see, bound to say, Srila Bhakti Deva Madhav Goswami Maharaj, the great Acharya, who was totally in line of Prabhupada Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. He was bound to say that Bharati Maharaj is number one Brahmachari, Nishthavan Brahmachari, is a real Brahmachari in our Gauriya Vaishnava society. Is a real Brahmachari. You can ask question, you can put question in front of me, Maharaj. So much, so many Brahmacharis are there. So why Bharati Maharaj, why, it, why you know, Madhukosya is speaking this way? Yes, we can discover, we can see so many Brahmacharis there. In the society of this more, that more, this more, this society. You can collect thousands of Brahmacharis. But as per the opinion of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, as per the opinion of Bhagavan Sri Krishna, same thing, as per the opinion of Prabhupada, they are not Brahmachari. They are not Brahmachari, they are not sannyas. I know you can become angry by hearing me, but I have no enmity with anybody. I am sitting here to act as a servant of my Guru Bhargava. My speaking Harikatha 
is one kind of topmost servitor say Harikatha. I have no power to change any dot, full stop, anything, any quotation, no power. So in true sense, so in true sense, Bhaktivita Madhu Goswami has told, he was bound to say that Narottama Brahmachari is an ideal Brahmachari. Many times he told, Narottama Brahmachari is an ideal Brahmachari. What do you mean by? Now some question came from South Africa, no? Somebody put him, what do you mean by idealism? I told idealism mean, I mean to say, idealism are shown by Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Or, in following succession, Allah Guru Varga, Swarup Gosai, Yorupu Rupagnath, Bhakti Mahathagur, Prabhupada, but that idealism I mean. I mean the original idealism is the Chaitanya Mahaprabhu idealism. That is idealism I mean. So, Narottama Brahmachari is an ideal Brahmachari. Madhav Goswami had told. Brahmachari means 100%, 100% engaged in Guru Seva. Full concentration. By our mind, it divided into different parts. Like Markari, you know, thermometer. When you break your thermometer, all the mercury inside the capillary can scatter. You cannot collect. You can try to collect. You try to collect, it can go away. You can really all scattered. You cannot get to that. Our mind, position of our mind, condition of our mind, wicked mind is like this. But it was not like this. In the case of Bhakti began Bharati Maharaj. One, one so-called man, one so-called man, he told Prabhupada one day, Prabhupada speaking about Brahmacharya, Sannyasi, what is the glorification of... Now one uh, man is speaking in front of Prabhupada. Prabhupada, I am also Brahmachari. I am not married. Somebody speaking to Prabhupada. I am not married. I am also Brahmachari. Prabhupada speaking. If this is the, if this is the, in a condition that if somebody is not married, he can be called Brahmachari, then the animal there in the Jews, lion, tiger, they are more and more uh, successful Brahmachari than you. If this is the, if this is the definition of your Brahmachari, simply because you are not married, so you are uh, going to claim that you are Brahmachari. This is not Brahmachari. I am not married, so I am Brahmachari. So many, bo I know, men coming to take Brahmachari in us, in different modes. But in true sense, they are not Brahmachari. They are not sannyas. They cannot prove. Because always try to stop fighting. When you can stop fighting, when you can see, that it is the it is a standard set by our Guru Varga. It is a standard set by our Guru Varga. Uh, who am I to set standard? Who am I to pass remark? I learned from Guru Varga. Prabhupada told, Bhakti Muttav told, if anybody like to write something, speak something, Harikatha, write something, or going to uh, show some etiquette, all should be all should be approved by, all should be approved by Sarup Gosai, the sole authority of our whole Sampradaya. Sarup Gosai. Then you cannot fight with me. How you can fight with me? Guru Varga told, any of your writing, you say, why is a great Acharya all over the world? So you don't fight with me, please. You go and search. What Prabhupada told, Bhakti Mahathakur told, Madhav Goswami, very shortly I am going to publish so many things, all the documents, what, you know, Madhav Goswami told, one, all. If you like to read, you cannot read, that's up to you. But it's my duty. So, main point, main point is that we have no idea. Who is going to maintain 
who is going to maintain the strict regulation of Guru Vaishnava? I mean, who is going to follow the idealism of Guru Bhargava? He can surely get power. If the whole world is going to reject him, I cannot hear. I cannot. I don't like, we don't like to keep any relationship. You are like, as you like, you can go. But surely, he is approved by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Because he is getting the approval of Sarup Gosai. Until and unless it is approved by Sarup Gosai, no writing, no speech, no, I mean, Harikatha, no etiquette, is just failure, all failure. I mean, just unable to get the stamp approval of Sarup Gosai. Sarup Gosai approval. So, Bharati Maharaj is enjoying the approval of Sarup Goshai. Bharati Maharaj is not giving some bribe to me, the five lakh rupees to me in my pocket so I can speak about him. You cannot prove that I have taken money from Bharati Maharaj, so I am speaking. Follow. So, surely, Bharati Maharaj is also speaking the same thing. Bharati Maharaj is speaking the same thing, what I am speaking. I can publish very shortly. So, who is getting, who is getting the approval of Sarup Gosai? Then he is successful. So, Srila Bhakti Bala of Tithya Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Bhagavan Bharati Maharaj, they are enjoying the full kripa of Guru Varga. Full kripa of Guru Varga. Full kripa of Guru Varga. Even Bhartima is going to pass remark. Bhartima is going to pass remark. Many times he told me, Be Maharaj, everybody thinking that Bhartima is a great learned man. He told me personally. But it is not so. It is a miracle of my satsanga. He told me. Maharaj, everybody thinking that I am a great learned man. I gone through Ved, Vedanta, everything, but it is just a miracle of my satsanga. By the mercy of Guru Pat Padma, I could realize how to do satsanga, how to do satsanga, how to avoid a satsanga. That fine intuition of that. By the mercy of Guru Pat Padma. If I want to learn all in details about the idealism of Bhakti Vita Mahadu Gose Maharaj. I will have to depend upon Bharti Maharaj. Prabhupada speaking many times. Somebody asking, Prabhupada, when we can get, when we can get Bhagavad Darshan, when we can... Prabhupada speaking, if there is at all no question of your Guru Darshan, how you can get Bhagavad Darshan? Foolish. Prabhupada was speaking, if at all there is no question of any Guru Darshan in your life, you are unable to reach up to the point when you can see Guru Charan for free. You don't know where from the question of Bhagavad Darshan. Hey, idiot number one. Bhagavad Darshan. So easy. Eh? Like Sahaja and Radha Kund and Navadip. Follow. Who was thinking, where from the question? If Guru Darshan is not there. So if Guru Darshan, if you ask me, I can say, complete Guru Darshan was there in the life of Bhakti Bhika and Bharati Maharaj. I can put guarantee. I can put guarantee about that. Because it was His Highness. I was with Him. This is also wrong Siddhanta. I was with Him for a long time here on the... I should not speak that way. It was, his, it was His Highness that out of His causeless mercy, He wanted to keep me with Him. Wanted to insp give me inspiration. In Jalandar, Punjab, everywhere. Now our Sambhava coming, He can speak Harikata. Everybody is speaking, expressing jealousy. But Bharat Maharaj in open assemblies, I am less interested to speak Harikata in front of them. What I can speak wrong, I don't know. No Siddhanta can. Bhakti Maharaj openly, now our Sambhava coming, we are very happy, now Sambhava can speak. But all other group, they are very sad, why Sambhava coming? They don't want I go, only 
Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj and Bhakti Vallati. They used to, you can stay with me. You can come with me here. Even to foreign countries, this is But I say, I am a fallen soul, how I can go? I have no power. You can go, you are Mukta Purush. I am Badda Jiva. They used to laugh. So, complete Guru Darshan, complete Guru Darshan, complete Vaishnava Darshan, if you like to get, then you will have to go through whole life of Bhakti Vigyan, Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. This was the... So, two jewels in Sri Chaitanya Gauri Maharaj. One is Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj, one is Bhakti Vallabh Chitra Maharaj. Right hand and left hand, huh? Bhakti Daitya Mahadev. So in the life of one Guru Pad Padma, in the life of one Guru Pad Padma, so many disciples can come. So many. Thousands of disciples can come. But who is genuine disciple of Guru Pad Padma? and who is not. That is the most vital point. How we can realize? By watching how tall figure, how nice his behavior, by this? No. By the help of his Bani Shiva, by the, by the mercy of his Bani Sharu, what he told, today if I, see, if I speak only, Bharati Mahaj actually too, too Birth in Bankura this time in the year of this, he brought and brought up there. After that, his schooling was done here. He is not, not Vaishnava Darshan, Guru Darshan. If I am successful to speak all about his Guru Darshan and Guru Seva, his Vaishnava Darshan, Vaishnava Seva, then my Harikatha today can get approval of Bharti Maharaj or Sarugosa, everybody, all our Guru Maharaj. Others not. All this simply, I can speak some, memorize and speak. Not there. So you are the main sevak, two vital sevaks. In Sri Chaitanya Gauri Mahat, one is Bhakti Vala Tithogasi Maharaj, another is Bhakti Vigyan Bharti Maharaj. Used to do seva. Bharti Maharaj used to say, it is the miracle of my Satsanga, it is the miracle of my Guru Sangha and Vaishnava Sangha that I can speak continuously non-stop Harikatha. And he expressed, he expressed his mood, prayer, that I like to speak Harikatha continuously up to my last, last moment of my life. He spoke. Up to my last moment of life, I like to speak what all I heard I mean, Sauta Pantha, Sauta Parampara, I can go on speaking all about this. Tirelessly. This is a symptom of pure Guru Vishnu. They can speak Harikatha tirelessly. They need not take rest. Follow what I say. So, I can speak some special incident by the help of which you can realize by the help of which you can realize, you know. Time to time, people used to give some donation. Bhakti Vita Madhuva Sema busy. All coming to Bharati Maharaj, either to Bharati Maharaj or to Bhakti uh, Bharati Maharaj or to Madhuva, uh, I mean, Tithu Goswami Maharaj. People, people, they, People, they used to say that Bharti Maharaj is the son of Bhakti Vita Madhav Goswami Maharaj. Many people used to ask question to Guru Deva, I mean, Bhakti Vita Madhav. He is your son, I think. Maharaj used to laugh. So much oneness of heart and similar to their mood and everything, almost. Yes, Bharti Maharaj's mood was almost like Bhakti Maharaj. I know. Many of them used to pass this kind of remark. I think uh, he is a son, you know. We think they used to pass, but not son. So they used to, 
They used to believe, they used to believe Bharati Goswami Maharaj. They used to believe Bharati Maharaj and Tithu Goswami Maharaj too. So, most of the donation used to come in the name of Bharati Maharaj and Tithu Maharaj. One day, when the construction going on Calcutta Mall, by the by I should speak, all the construction of different morts, all Calcutta Mort, Dehradun Mort, Puri Mort, whatever, all mod construction was a topmost engineer, is Bharati Maharaj. But practically you cannot find any certificate of engineering pass. No engineering certificate there. But he is an authorized engineer by Bhagavan, Prabhupada, or Guru Bhagavan. Miracle. If you, go, if you show him this is the land, Maharaj, this is this piece of land. You have to make this way. So here Natta Mandir must be there, Mandir must be there, and devotees can stay. Yes, you love. You cannot believe me, Santu Goswami Maharaj. You can come with me to Puri. I can show you, Santu Goswami Maharaj, his temple is not even, eh, this area must be, this, this much. This much area will room. Or maybe a little bit. Santuma speaking to Bharati Maharaj. Bharati Maharaj, you will make, you have to make such a design so all you know devotees can stay, Natya Mandir can be there, uh, everything, kuchi, kitchen, latrine also be there. Bharati was thinking, okay, Maharaj, no problem, you bless me. I'm going to make design. There are then more. Same case. It's like this area, a little, a little bit. Many times I've been there with Titokashi Maharaj or Bharati Maharaj. No space. They make first floor, second floor, second floor, they arrange temple. Ground floor, they make back and for cooking. No place. No cooking, no place, no devotee. Where they can stay? No place. So they make, you know, they make first underground. After they make first floor, their temple, and which way they can go up, they need not come inside. From road they can go straight away to temple, or even from inside you can go. So so many design. I was I was really surprised to see. I was really surprised to see he is not engineer, but is approved by Guru Bhargava. So surely he is engineer. So fine brain. Follow. Whenever he is going to make a design of any temple, he used to think about Guru Vaishnava. Those who are old Vaishnava, they are supposed to go second floor, third floor. So there should be this kind of provision should be there. A kitchen should be there. Natamundi should be there. Brahmacharya should be Fine calculation. Miracle. This is called Bharati Maharaj. Thousands of people are going to join one function. Bhakti Vita Madhav Goswami used to give all the responsibility to Bharati Maharaj and Tithu Maharaj too. They know very sure. So, by the by, what I mean to say, so all donation come. Gurudev speaking, Bharati Maharaj, you have any amount I can apply, I can, I like to use it for this construction. Bharati Maharaj speaking to Gurudev, Gurudev, they are sending, they are sending money for this purpose. So, how we can, how we can utilize it? Gurudev laughing. You give the money to me, I can give you back. If you give the money to me, I can give you back. Follow. Brajamandal Parikrama, Navadip Dham Parikrama, any Parikrama, all, wherever you go, Purushottam Dham, any function, I have my practical experience. Na? Practical experience. So long as Srila Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj was there, I was feeling very happy to speak Harikatha in Purushottam Dham Chaitanya Goswami. I mean, the Abhirbha place of Prabhupada. Now I am not going. So long as Srila Bharati Maharaj was there, the, the assembly was very serious assembly. Because there is an influential Vaishnava, na? 
So I was feeling many harikatha there on internet, you can find. Bharati Maharajan. Bharati Maharajan allowed me to speak, I am speaking. So long as Bharati Maharaj was there alive, I was feeling happy to go. Now I am not. Because one or two times I went there, I saw that harikatha is not so important for them. They like to stop harikatha. Pujari is going to offer bhoga. We started Horikata after 11, 11.30. So at least you should continue up to uh, 2 o'clock. Oh, okay, up to 1.30 or 2. But when Pujari offer book, they say, Maharaj, now we finish Harikata now. Even Aruti is not there. You will have to wait for another, uh, you have to wait for uh, half an hour, one year, one hour for two. You have to wait. Aruti after that, Bhoga can come out. And even Madhu Goswami many times told, it happened in my life. I speaking Harikatha in Chagda Jagannath Mandir, Kartik Bharato, many times Harikatha, Bengali. One time one Pujari become very angry that my Harikatha continue. Not going to, so I am not going to stop. He became so angry that he started opening and started Aruti. I was stunned. They think Aruti is so important. They think Aruti is so idiot, so rascal, so fallen, so fallen. They think Aruti is so important. They don't know Aruti going on by Harikatha. They don't know. Madhukusima told me this. This Siddhanta Madhukusima told me. Hey, you stop Harikatha. Hey, you stop Aruti. Or you do Aruti inside. Rosa. You know, scream and do Aruti inside. Yeah, Harikatha is Aruti. But foolish people, they are not getting any satsanga. So how they can know this Siddhanta? Follow. This is the condition. Poor condition. So, he used to speak Harikatha continuously, particularly or date, sequence, where Harikatha, which situation, all you can remember. Forty-five years ago, this, this Babu, a Sanjay Babu came in Jalanda to meet me this way. Whenever I was speaking, forty-five years back, forty-five years back, the Sanjay Babu came in Jalanda to meet with me, speaking Harikatha. His brain was one kind of encyclopedia. <laughs> of history Bhaman Gosima also. You can remember all historical data. It was in the year of 1972, uh, this happened. <laughs> He's speaking this way. Abnormal brain. Abnormal brain? Extraordinary brain. <laughs> Extraordinary brain, you used to remember. So all response brain. So many incidents. Bharti Maharaj was bound to speak one very important thing. But I know at present no Acharya, no devotee, no sannyasi can approve it. But I approve it. Because many times I told the same thing. Bharti Maharaj used to say that under the guidance of Guru Pad Padma, perfect guidance of Guru Pad Padma, in my life I could realize the glories of Unity in diversity. Bhartimar told. That is the miracle in our life. Unity in diversity. Bhartimar told, Tito Maharaj, Tito Goswami told, so many they told. They externally all of our Guru Bhargava, those who are sincere Guru Bhargava, those who are actual eternal persons of Prabhupada. They used to serve Prabhupada, staying in different places. But they had harmony among them. But big, big Acharya is going to criticize. They are broken, all gone, finished. I am the only Acharya speaking. But I can give one by one example. Let them fight me. Let them fight me, let them go to court. I have all documents I can show you. This Acharya told you. This Bhaktivikan Bharatima told you. Madhu Goswami told you. Prabhupada told but All documents are there. They let them go to court. I am not going to insult, I am less interested in insult anybody. But I am very much interested 
to protect the dignity of our Guru Bhargava. I cannot allow you to go untouched. If I find you are going to insult my Guru Varga, I can catch your throat. I can catch your throat. Why God? Follow what I say. So Bhartama has told that under the guidance, under the perfect guidance of Bhakti Do Madhu Goswami Maharaj, we learn how to do Vaishnav Seva. My Guru Padma never told. Don't do seva of that sadhu. He is not there. He has not done nothing. Is of they are rascal. Not my god brother. Never do. Even, even, Madhugusya. Even those in Guru Bharga, they have done so many things against Bhakti with Madhugusya. He was sick. Bharatma speaking to Bharatma speaking to. I you know. Dr. Vita Mahatma Goswami is speaking to Bharati Maharaj. If you love me, you will have to serve my good God brother. Maharaj, he criticizes you. I say you serve him. You think it is my seva. You show me one example. You show me an example from your society. Maybe you are international society, you show me. One example, one I like to hear. Only one who is speaking, the all, you know, all Bhagavad not speaking. One example you saw me, not many. Then Bhartima is speaking all the time, glorification. Glorification all the time of Guru Varga. Bhartima is speaking, I, I, it was my, this was my success. My Guru Maharaj, under the guidance of Guru Maharaj, I learned. How to serve Guru Vaishnava, which is the key to success. Which is the key to success. How to serve Guru Vaishnava. If Guru Ma if Guru Padma Guru Bhargu want to engage me in Manishava, I'll have to give total everything to my Guru Bhargu. If Guru Padma like to engage him in some in some other seva, like Narahari Prabhu was engaged. Narari Prabhu, Prabhu was engaged in the in maintenance of Chaitanya Mahat. It matters little what seva you are given by. So, he was successful, Narari Prabhu. Whole day and night he is maintaining Chaitanya Mahat. Because if Chaitanya Mahat is well maintained, if Chaitanya Mahat is well maintained without any problem, then Prabhupada can feel satisfaction, can concentrate in Bani Shiva. So this very secret thing. Very secret thing. So Bharati Maharaj told that unity and diversity we have seen in your life. We under the guidance of Guru Padma, we already learned how to tolerate, how to bear, how to do seva. Everything. Exclusive seva mood. Exclusive seva mood was there with Bhakti Vigan Bharati Maharaj. One or two examples I can give to you. When I can say, when I can say that the disciple is 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 Guru Shevak, hundred percent Guru. When I can say, when Guru Padma his heart totally harmonized with disciple. When the heart of disciple, when the heart of disciple can get harmonized with Guru Path Padma, eh? Popad used to say, uh, one uh, one uh, pot is there, like sub, like a talcum powder or anything. A cap is there, no? Popad speaking, if the cap is open. If you put the cap there, the cap should be ad totally adjusted, you know? huh? dovey tailed, totally adjusted. Boba used to you. So the heart of Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj and the heart of Bhakti Vala Tvita Goswami Maharaj was totally harmonized with Madhav Goswami. That is why so many miracle things 
we can discover in the life of Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. One or two examples I can say. Brajamandal Parikama going on. Big problem. After that Parikama over, Bhakti, Bala, Bhakti Daita Madhu Gosimaj is uh, supposed to go to his Bhajan Kutir, I mean to temple, to take bath and uh, no, go back. Parikama is over. And Bharati Maharaj was bound to stay there for some reason. He cannot go with Gurudev. He was bound to stay there for some time, maybe one hour. He will have to stay more to complete the seva. In the meantime, when Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami already gone by one rickshaw, already gone. Then Bharati Maharaj remember, Ari, Guru Pat Padma cannot enter into the room because the key is there with me. I come with Guru Pat Padma, with lock and key, I key is with me. Key is there with me. How Guru Maharaj can enter? Oh my God! It will take another. Eh? It will take one one hour minimum for me to one or two hour. So how what I can do? Immediately one Muslim mystery. He was supposed to go that way. He said, "With your bike, you immediately go and you meet our Guru Maharaj and give the key." It was after twenty minutes or thirty minutes. He remember then. That mystery was successful to hand over the key to Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami. After receiving the key, Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami could realize the meaning of Guru Shevak. He could realize that day who is Guru Shevak. He could realize. Follow. Many times, many times, Guru Pat Padma Bhaktivedanta Madhuga Simaj, his acharan, what is the meaning of this acharan? Bhaktivedanta speaking. Many times it happens. All. I cannot realize the, uh, why Guru Pat Padma is speaking this. Follow. Madhuga Simaj could realize that he cannot understand the inner meaning of my, what I am, why I am doing this. Suppose some devotee is giving nice cloth and chadar, very costly cloth and chadar to Bharti Goswami Maharaj. And many people do, I am also keeping and giving to somebody. Then one day, Bharti, I mean, I am Gurudev speaking. Bharti Maharaj, you can. That time he was Narottam Brahmachari, that time he was not Sanyasi. Brahmachari was. So you can go to market to get, uh, to get some ordinary dhoti, to get some ordinary ration, ration. In ration, government used to give very cheap price. In our time also, flat price. Then Madhu Kusma, uh, Bharti Mahal speaking, Gurudev, already I have so many dhoti, so why not you give from, I can give one or two if you ask. Bhakti Vita Madhu Gosan looking at his face. You will have to go and buy, you will have to go to market and buy ordinary dhoti. As I say, you will have to. Why you know? I know you like to give dhoti and chadar to that brahmachari. But, the, but that brahmachari is coming from a very low family, very poor. I have no discrimination. I like to give him. But he never enjoyed wearing very nice clothes. If I right now, he is coming only two, three months. If I right now, if you go on, if I start giving, he cannot stay in mud. So first of all, I like to develop, I like to see the development of his detachment. I like to see. So don't be, don't be in hurry. So what I say, you do it. I know you have nice clothes, you can give chadar everything. Don't. If you give him, then he cannot stay in temple. He can develop a you know, sensual enjoying mood and he can fall down. I like to protect. It is my it is my causeless mercy. It is my causeless mercy that I like to provide him very ordinary cloth. But you think Bhakti the Madhav is very you think so? It is your 
So this is the man. In Kumbha Mela, many times I go, my Guru Maharaj also go. I never went. In my whole life, I never went to any Kumbha Mela. Prabhupada also never went in Kumbha Mela. And I am less interested to go in Kumbha Mela. I have no desire to go in Kumbha Mela. I like to hear Harikatha from Bhakti Vita Madhugusi Maharaj or from our Guru Bhargava. I like to, uh, this is my desire. This is my desire. I like to hear Harikatha from them continuously. Sometimes I am feeling. But anyway, Harikatha, Guru Bhargava speaking, that's why Harikatha coming inside my they are speaking Harikatha and relay coming to me. They are speaking Harikatha and relay coming to me. I am speaking. I am instrument. Follow. One another in incident I can speak. Bharti Maharaj was there in Kumbha Mela because it was one Guru Seva, a big Chaitanya Mahapu Seva on behalf of Gauriya Mahat. They used to open. One, because people, different people coming, they can get the scope to hear about the teachings of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. It is very good. They have no personal desire to go to Kumbha Mala. I am also not saying that it is prohibited, but I am less interested. Anyway, so Maharaj and our North Bharati Maharaj, that time he was Bharati Maharaj. He took birth in there, in Kumbha Mela, maybe the confluence of Ganga, Yamuna, Saraswati, maybe Elahavad. After that, Gurudev and disciple, I mean Madhu, I mean Bharti Mahan, they are walking down the street, going to their tent, tent, you know, tent, tent. In the meantime, one old lady, very nice lady, very soft, uh, coming with some halwa, halwa. In hand, very nice halwa. Maharaj, Maharaj, please you take this halwa. This you know, take and one cloth and chadar. I like to give to you, Maharaj. You take. Madhugusi Maharaj. Madhugusi speaking to. Bartuma, you take. Bartuma is hesitating. Why should I take? He is not devotee. He is not devotee. He likes to give, he has uh, shraddha. He likes to give. Bhartama speaking, I, our Bhaktivita Madhu Goswami speaking, you please accept what she is giving. After taking, now go. Then he was, she was very happy. She paid Nandavat to Madhu Goswami Maharaj and Narto, I know, Bhaktivita Madhu Goswami Maharaj and to Bhartama Maharaj and the con. Bhakti Maharaj could realize the heart, I mean, our Bhakti Vaitam Adhukusana could realize the heart. Speaking, you see, those who are bonded soul, if you reject them, first hand, they can fall down. They can, they sadhu, they can to reject and no mercy. So first of all, we should have mercy. They are giving, okay, you accept it. After that, if you like to distribute to somebody, you can give it, but first of all, if you reject them, she can st start crying. Bhartama speaking, in each and every fraction of second, I got the scope to learn so many things from my Guru Pāk Padma. That is why Bhartama Maharaj was totally harmonized with Bhakti Dito Too much oneness. Too much oneness. Follow. By watching some external incident, somebody going to pass remark, bad remark about Bharati Maharaj. By watching some external incident, an unusual incident, somebody going to speak that Gauriya Mart break down. But they forget that Gauriya Mart is not a construction of sand and brick. Government of Prakito. So I think they are all material. Otherwise, how they are going to pass this kind of river? They have no trace of bhakti for Prabhupada. For Prabhupada. I am 100% sure. I can touch Bhagavad Ji Mahaprabhu. So confident I am. Otherwise, I can, Bhagavad Ji Mahaprabhu can burn me. So much confidence. That no faith, 
They have no faith in Prabhupada. They have no faith in Gauriya Guru Parampara. They have no faith in Gauriya Mat. That's why they are going to pass this kind of remarks. They think Gauriya Mat is a material construction. There is breakdown. This is their remark. You should not speak like that. Then Prabhupada can never forget you. Prabhupada, the Prabhupada can never forget you. You speak this way. So somebody is going to pass a remark about Bharti Maharaj. Because most of the time used to, I used to stay with uh, in Chaitanya Gorimat, Calcutta for publication seva. Many times, outside seva. Always. I am grateful to Bhakti Vigyan Bharati Maharaj. I am grateful to Bhakti, Bhakti Balla Tithu Goswami Maharaj. I am grateful to Bhakti Vigyan Madhu Goswami. Most of the time I used to stay there, Calcutta, staying with Tithu Maharaj and Bharati Maharaj all. I was lucky to see their character, behavior, all efficacy. So, if my wicked mind like to do something wrong, then, then they can beat with chapel on my head. Hey, you got our association. How you are doing? How dare? So, I, if, if my wicked mind like to do some wrong, but still I cannot do it. Immediately, if I go into room, then I can see my Guru Vargo watching, waiting to arrest me. This was their causeless kipa. I cannot forget Bharti Maharaj. I can never forget Bharti Maharaj. This is not this life. Life after life, I cannot forget Bharti Maharaj. It's so mercy. When I heard from one sannyasi, one sannyasi, from Bhakti Kumar Mahasun Goswami Maharaj is smart. One sannyasi told me, this year, you could not attend the Abhirbhav Titi of Prabhupada. Bharti Maharaj was there. And you wrote so many protest notes. You got the approval of Bharti Maharaj, Tithumar, all Guru Varga, Sarup Gosai, all, everything. Bharti Maharaj used to read my all, all articles, all books. Very nice. Even one single dot, full stop, he never changed. Bengal, Bengal, Hindi. English now going to be published. English, I publish, but not so much because limited power, so much people, so much, you know, seva. That Bambuchari speaking, in the open assembly, Bharati Maharaj in, Bharati Maharaj in open assembly, open assembly, Bharati Maharaj speaking in his Harikatha, when Prabhupada glorification speaking, after the speaking, that on behalf of Saraswat Gauriya, Vaishnav Sangha, Srila Shyam Baba published so many protest notes. You must go through those protest notes to know so many information. I wondered. And nobody up to now, nobody told openly. Somebody approved, like Bhopananda Man Maharaj, or so many senior Maharaj. So many senior Maharaj, they told, but no, openly in front of public. Bhavarati Maharaj openly in public. Told, see, openly. Told. But in that mart, so many devotees, sannyasi, they are criticizing. Why, why some of are writing this? Why? No, no, he cannot do his own bhajan. Why are writing this? They are speaking. But they don't know what is called bhajan. They don't know what is called bhajan. I told you, na, when some when some Babaji's from Navadip Dham wanted to approach our Bhakti Vinod Thakur in Krishnanagar, that's why that time he was majestic majesty. Then so many devotees going to complain against the Sarup, Sarup Das Baba of that. He is not doing bhajan. They are speaking, complain. He has no bhajan. Every day, almost every day, he is going there after Krishna to file one case in the name of uh, some or other. Every day he is going there in Krishna to file one case in the name of some. He has no, not doing bhajan. Bhakti Vinod Thakur told, actually he is doing bhajan. Actually he is doing bhajan. All Sahajya Babaji is there in Navadip Dham. They are like to get the association of widow lady, 
in the night time, some of them going to cheat widow lady, some of them going to grasp all the property of Bhagavan, Devatta Sampati, so he cannot be here. So every day, almost every day, he is coming to file one case in the name of some rascal. Actually, he is doing bhajan. You are not doing bhajan. You are sitting inside a solitary room and chanting Harinam is not bhajan. You are sitting inside a solitary room, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, not bhajan. But he is doing bhajan. Follow. So, I can say, Bharti, Srila Bhaktivik and Bharti Maharaj was the number one Gauriya Sevak, a jewel, a treasure of Gauriya Mart. His idealism, his bhajan was so nice. Hours after hours we have seen speaking Harikatha. At the same time doing Harinam also. How powerful. Speaking Harikatha or doing Harinam. Follow. This way, endless glories of Srila Bhaktivedanta and Bharti Maharaj. I am a teeny bird, how I can fly in the soul. The sky is infinity, according to the capacity of a bird can fly. So, I, I am bound to stop here. Guru Anugrahen Noi Vapaman Purna Pashantvaye. You can remember? By the mercy of Guru Padma, you can become very peaceful. Guru Rano Gruhenaivo Puman Purna Prashantwe Banchakal Bhatur Sikh Pasanda Bhajya Patitana Pavana Bhoshana Bhyo Namon Yai Sila Bhaktivikan Bhati Kasi Maharaj Giya So the Abir Bhakti Tipara Mahamasaki. I cannot forget his affection. Always I remember his affection. Inside room, how he used to exchange view with me. 